Hey, what's he doing? All right, so we're in Walmart and Patricia found Mr. Tackle Box panned fish and trout fishing kits for eight bucks. So I'm gonna have her pick a number out. I think she's going with 350. There's a lot of those. But uh, I think I, I opened one of these before a long time ago, but it was like 230 something. So we'll see what the uh, difference is in those. Maybe it has some Guggen stuff in it. <laughs> you dancing with mamas? That's like three dollars cheaper. Had to get him changed. Tried to have a blowout. Him some new sleepers and whatnot since he's getting big. These are definitely on. Yeah, I mean, they're ringing in like way cheaper. Not this one. I'm just curious if this is actually $8. Let's see. Hey. I told you it was $8. All right, guys, so down here in the basement, we've got this box here, and uh, we're going to do a little unboxing on it, so pull the tab back here on the back. Um, yeah, let's see what we got. It's a, uh, it's not the bass fishing kit, it's the uh, pan fish and trout fishing kit, so be some stuff in there maybe for bluegill, maybe some crappie, stuff like that, so let's see what we got. This is a uh, box number 350. So I think the last one I did was like 239 or something like that. It's been a while since I've actually opened one of these. Uh, yeah, so let's see what we got. Um, as always, they got their big um, measuring tape there and all that. Um, got the Dibble Digest. Kind of shows what, what all's in here and uh, just some fishing tips and stuff like that for panfish and stuff for this time of year. And uh, we got a what's inside list here. Uh, you can scan that, but it's got pretty much everything on there listed. Uh, it doesn't have the prices of them, so I might have to search that up, but let's see what we got. All right, so first thing I'm seeing here, we got a pretty cool sticker. Catch Co sticker. I'm not sure what in the world he's fighting. Looks like he's fighting a jig. There you go. Yeah, he's fighting a football jig. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Um, oh, I like this. I like that color. Um, I'm not sure what brand this in is, but it's called it's a Bell Spin. Um, too hot. But check that out. I like that color. It's like a orange and yellow and stuff like that. Clear water. I bet that thing would be awesome. Um, yeah, that's pretty sweet. So that, on these bell spins, where that orange is, that kind of like makes a ton of noise in the water. Plus it's got the blade, which is pretty cool. Um, all right. Well, there's the first thing there. Uh, let's see. Oh, we got some little worm weights. A seven pack of worm weights. So, rig those up, put a, you know, night crawler or earthworm or something like that on there and rip some bluegill with it. Um, let's see. These are pretty cool. Euro Tackle. Um, B-Vibe. It's a two-inch eight-pack scented. Those are pretty sweet. They're like a little tiny swim bait. Um, little bitty little thing. Let's see if we can get one out of here. I don't really want to. Well, I don't want to open that up because I won't be able to hang it on my bait wall back here But until I get to use it. But that's pretty sweet. I like the yellow. It's like a yellowish gold. Almost like, I think it's like almost like the motor oil color um, when they do that. But that's pretty sweet. Um, all right. Excite baits. I've heard of these guys. 
Um, just some curly tail grubs and like a hot pink. There it is, Excite Baits. Pretty cool. High flutter. Okay, so these float. That's pretty cool. Um, yeah, that's pretty sweet. All right. Let's see what else we got here. Lake Fork. Oh, dude, these are pretty sweet. Okay, so it's like a little jointed. Check that out. They're like a little jointed swim bait, but they're small, dude. They're like two and a half inches long. Let me see. Does it say on here? Uh, it doesn't say what size they are, but those are small, dude. Let's see if we can open it up without having to tear it. Oh, yeah, we can. Okay. Dude, check that out. The thing is pretty daggone cool. Join a little swim bait with a little, little ball on the end, but that's pretty sweet. That would be probably pretty cool for crappie, I'd imagine. Um, all right, pretty cool. And the last time we got, oh yeah, the Death Stalker. I actually have one of these already. But this is a different color combo. But there's the Death Stalker. So it's got the little willow blade on the back, treble hook on the bottom there. It's a little flat sided bait. I don't think last time when I had these, I didn't pull it out of the package. So let's pull this one out of the package and actually look at it a little bit. Oh yeah, that's sweet. There you go. Now you can get a really good look at it. So yeah, it's got that little blade on the back. Um, but yeah, that thing will probably be pretty cool at um, my neighbors or granddad's, something like that. And I know you can catch some bigger ones on those too. Um, yeah, that's pretty sweet. I like the silver. I have a different color of it. Um, when I got this box last time, but, uh, yeah, all right, well, pretty good variety of stuff, um, I mean, I'm not really sure the prices on all these, but it looks like it's a, especially for what we paid for, we only gave eight bucks for it, I know this Death Stalker by itself is almost that, so, uh, I'd say we did pretty good on it, I'd, I was kind of surprised because like we were walking in Walmart and we just happened to be looking. We were looking for a little pool for Oakland, um, just a little blow up pool or something like that. And she's like, "Hey, they got Mr. Tackle Box over here for eight bucks." I'm like, "There's no freaking way!" But sure enough, it rang up eight dollars, and uh, yeah, I'd say that's well worth that. But um, yeah, so just to go over again, we got the Death Stalker. Got the lake fork, um, little swimmers there. We got the excite baits, curly tail grub. We got these little swimmers there by Euro Tackle. Um, we got the hooks, and we got the bell spin. And then after that, we also got the sticker. So pretty cool, I'd say as a really good deal for eight bucks uh yeah pay attention at your walmarts um there was like three different box numbers there so um i'm not sure if like all the colors are the same through the box numbers and all that um but either way it's uh, definitely worth eight bucks but yeah just thought i'd do a little unboxing for you guys um with it being that big of a value so anyways let me get, know what you guys think and uh was it worth the eight bucks? So anyways, I appreciate you guys watching and we'll see y'all in the next one.